The Sarasota Memorial Hospital are entering a new phase of clinical trials for a COVID-19 treatment. Eight on your side's Justin Shecker explains. Sarasota Memorial Hospital is testing a new antibody cocktail that attacks coronavirus. Soon this trial won't just be for patients who need to be hospitalized. You know, the whole idea of shutting down the economy to flatten the curve was to sort of let us catch up. In the months leading up to the summer surge in the Sunshine State, SMH doctors tell Eight on Your Side they've learned how to better take care of COVID-19 patients. Remdesivir, uh, we know that it has uh, efficacy, but the convalescent plasma, you can actually see that people, people will be spiking temperatures and then 12 hours or so after giving the convalescent plasma, you can see things calm down. SMH doctors say those blood donations are running low and the demand is increasing for remdesivir, an antiviral medication that's shown to shorten the duration of illness. The government and Gilead is working in a system for distribution. So every, every Monday, we get a supply for the week. Starting next week, Sarasota Memorial is expanding its trial of an antibody treatment that doesn't rely on human donations, but rather it's grown in the Regeneron Pharmaceuticals labs. Our patients that don't need to be hospitalized could be eligible for this study, and we're, we're, we're excited about that. It's yet another way this Bay Area hospital is catching up in the fight against coronavirus. Something that may make just a, a percent difference uh, saves lives. And doctors say the extremely sick are excluded from this trial. To qualify, all you need is a positive test and at least one symptom. I'm Justin Shecker, 8 on your side.